Welcome to another plan with me. Today we're going to be planning in my happy planner. I was really excited, obviously, to see the beautiful plan a happy life um, spread for February in the Amy Tangerine happy planner and I love the theme colors so I wanted to create a theme that was really solely orientated around that but I also wanted a Dutch door and I wanted to be able to use my hourly spreads what a conundrum so I decided to make a Dutch door in my happy planner to do this, all I did was measured up the sides and I cut down the sides that I wouldn't be using. I was happy to lose my Sunday on the other side because I don't really use my weekend spreads too much because I really only just consider the weekend as a weekend, not two separate days. So once I was done, I thought it would be a good idea to make some tabs to be able to easily find the weeks that I was looking for. To make these tabs, I easily did this by measuring up the sides and making sure that they were all aligned. I started with the top and worked my way down, labeling the weeks of that particular month. Once the last one was ready, I was ready to put them in my notebook and ready to start my planning spreads. What I really like about these spreads is it can be unique for any person. Here I started with my washi tape. I kind of covered up the last couple of hours of the day because I wasn't really going to need them. I then used some watercolour to fill in some of the pages. What I really again like about the Happy Planner is the paper is pretty thick so you can actually use watercolour on it without it bleeding through. I also used some washi tape to make a really great background and then did a really fun kind of theme around um, some of the palm trees for that tropical inspired spread. I made another sky with washi tape making it really easy again using just stickers to fill in those blank spaces. I don't need all of the space in my personal planner so I cover up quite a lot of it with stickers because I like to keep memories in there too. So it makes it a really good way to give me the kind of scrapbook feel that I really like and also the structure that I need from a planner. As we come to the end, you can see that I'm just finishing up with a couple of extra stickers and a couple of finishing touches, just to make it feel really sprightly and tropical. Right, now that all my pages are done, I'm gonna pop them straight into my planner and finish everything off. I'm going to add a blue pocket because it's the blue theme I thought it would look really lovely. I'm also going to add a little task sheet just to make it easier for me to find things during the week. As always, thanks for watching and please hit the subscribe button. We'd love to hear from you in the comments below as well. Thank you.